Ready? Let's get started. My listener, stand by. Knowing how to use words can compel an audience to listen. Knowing what words to say and how to say them can captivate. Q. Chris Etter, an instructor at the Defense Information School just south of Baltimore, Maryland. He teaches military students how to write and speak. In 16 training days, we basically teach our students how to re-speak, re rebreathe, and rewrite. And it's pretty intense. For some military students, it's easier said than done. No one knows you've made a mistake until you go, <sighs> No NPJs. No NJP. Oh, wow, well, I'm dyslexic. Yeah, no NJPs. We have about a 37% chance that you're going to be either washed out uh, recycled or eliminated from the course. Those who do go net f further uh, go into video skills where they'll learn uh, some type of editing platform, video camera work, and ad adva advanced uh, visual storytelling. As a master sergeant with 21 years of service, Chris Etter doesn't have to be here. He could be a retired. He could be Marines Mr. Etter. I have a vested interest in here, and, and all these students know it. They know that when I tell them something, I'm not just telling them something just to hear myself speak. I'm telling them because it's important and I want to share that information with them. He simply wants to make sure the next wave of military storytellers we got this. are better storytellers. And he's here to inspire. You got this. Tell me. Tell me you got, got it. got this. Thank you. I almost believe you. Reporting from Fort Meade. We can do this. I'm Sergeant Curtis Villa Vicencio.